Avengers number one. You know, I had to get the Scarlet Witch variant cover because, well, I think she's the best. I mean, who else do you think is the best? All those guys. Anyways, oh, Scarlet Witch on the cover. Yes, and we have Captain Marvel. I think, okay, this must have been the last page is a dinger. You guys got to watch the whole thing to see the last page, but this might be like a part of like the last page because it has a similar background. Everyone has their own reason for doing this. I can only guess at some of them. Tony is his past and he's trying to make things a net positive. Thor, he does it because of the Mayfly lives in the face of his immortality, stirs something inside of him, something deep in his bowels. Cause like, they do this and they don't live forever. And Thor lives forever, so I don't know. Um, it would be easy for a god to take the long view and forget the everyday triumphs and terrors of mortals. But for me, it's this, this beautiful, fragile gas and vapor surrounded by water and dirt and all the beautiful things that live on it. The gem of the infinite worth called the Earth. We call ourselves the Avengers. It is a warning for ourselves, not our enemies, because to avenge something, you must first have lost it. And this is something that we can't afford to lose, the Earth. Uh, Iron Man and to Captain Marvel, we've got a live one. I'm on my way. You're not going to say it, are you? You are the chair. Of course I'm going to say it. Avengers, assemble! So we have this, like, I, I don't even know what the creature... There's, like, food right here. I have to move it because it's staring at me. Um... I forgot what this creature is called, but he's taken over, and every time they put him down, he grows stronger, and he's after the Project Pegasus Power. Here's our key players. Yo, I thought, I was like, what the heck? How is, how is Captain Marvel flying? But it's like the Sam version of Captain Marvel. Yeah, that's how he's flying. Seven days ago. So... And there came a day, a day unlike any other, when Earth's mightiest heroes found themselves united against a common threat on the day the Avengers were born to fight the foes no other superhero could withstand. Yeah. Okay, the votes are in. Our new chairperson is Captain Marvel. Hooray! Aren't you ready to go out and police the world? No. What do you mean, no? The Avengers aren't cops. Or at least we shouldn't be in... That that just doesn't work. That just gives gets us back into more civil wars. The Avengers were more like firemen. We're here. We're the ones to fly into the blaze, wherever it is, because we're the ones who can. So we're the ones who have to. We save lives. That's it. That's our whole mission statement. Write it. Write it. Sign it. And date it. Huh. Interesting. Okay, so the Avengers are in transition phase after what we went through in the God Quarry. Omega issue number one, Avengers Assemble. Um, you need to reach out and rebuild your team. No sweat. I already know who's on number one. Tony Stark, come on down. Actually, it would be actually number two. You're number one. They just said it. So Tony Stark is number two, man. Seriously? I'm your first pick? I thought it would be Jessica Drew. Yeah, right. She's not even cool. Just kidding. Uh, Jess, Rhodes, and Jen, they're who I go to for Captain Marvel business. But you're the one who I go to for official Avengers business. And I want you to be my XO, my number two man. We've been on opposing sides before, and I didn't like that. So, it's time we work together. <laughs> For God's sakes, Tony, you're my sponsor. Is this like for drinking sponsor? AA type stuff? What does that mean? I need you. And given your recent events, you need us. You need us. Well, all right. That's two down. Who else you got? I've got some ideas. I've got some ideas. Iron Man, 
Uh, what are we looking at? Terminus. That's his name. Terminus. Oh, I don't know. What, where did this come in? Omega? Avengers Assemble Omega? I want to figure out who made this thing. Was this like a god mold type thing? Master mold creation? Sentinels? Whatever. No, because X-Men aren't here. Yeah, where did this come in? Tony. Oh, Tony created this? Bet I bet he did. I bet you he did accidentally create this. Alien cybernetic organism. Um, effective, effectively immortal. His pseudo nanite spores in the earth keep regrowing him every time he's defeated. He's accompanied by terminant, termini, smaller drawer drone forms of himself. I don't see those. What would they be on the cup? No, not the cover. What are the terminis? What are these terminis you speak of? Those are Quinjets, right? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. As for what he's after, well, it's the Pegasus Project. He's after the energy, the power. <laughs> power, that's my second pick. It's power. Thor used to be a lot more fun. I was never out of the Avengers. I was there in the beginning, and I will be there in the end. It's because, and she says exactly what she says earlier. Yeah, that's exactly right. Yes. He's been through a lot recently. <laughs> we all have. But when your dad died, I didn't... When my dad died, I didn't even have to lead any pantheon of gods. Though, I guess I do now. <laughs> I knew it. I knew that you were a mayfly lives in the face of immortality. Whatever she said earlier is kind of like... Yeah, I'm not going to repeat myself. Captain Panther, you're on civilian evac. Thor, you're on me. Ah, let's let him know we're here. I mean, what? What are we? What is this? What is her? I don't know. Beware, monsters! You would not be the first giant that I have felled, and you would not be the first giant that has been felled just today. Hmm. <laughs> What he's saying is stand down or we're going to put you down, Terminus. We're Avengers. And he and I are the nice ones. All right. So it keeps going back and forth to the Terminus fight and then to her grouping up the powerful allies. Who can you guess this is? Well, it's not Aquaman, even though he's on a boat. Who do you think? Who do you think? I thought it might have been Sam Wilson. It's T'Challa. How'd you find me? You wanted me to find you. <laughs> yeah, sure. Why would I want to be found, Carol? Uh, I don't know, T'Challa, because we sure didn't leave things on a sweet spot last time we talked. When you gave your sleeper cell to kill switch protocol, your sleeper cell, your kill switch protocols, and told them how to take down your Avenger friends. Huh. <sighs> so... This is why I wish to be found, that I may be scolded for my sins at this hour of the day. Nah, nah, you're too smart for that. Not the same way Tony's smart, but you're more like cunning, cannier than any of us, which is why I'm here. You know what you did was wrong, and you know what it cost. You're not even the king of ch 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 th that Wakanda anymore. You're not even Black Panther, officially. Do you know? Do you want to know why you wanted to be found? It was so I could come and say, come home, come and be an Avenger, join us. Because after all, you never stop being one. T'Challa, of course, he's in the team. And because even after that, I want you on my team. Captain Marvel the Black Panther, are you in? A moment. I was right, they are vulnerable by the Antarctic Vibranium. Oh, oh, these are the drone things. Okay. All right, I was like, what, what are the drone things? Continue down the hall. Oh, the Quinjets are waiting at the exit. Board them, the autopilot will take you to safety and as they have done your colleagues. But in order for us to forestall this catastrophe, I need the senior engineer with me. That's T'Challa talking to the scientists. 
Well, that's me, but I, I'm afraid. I can't. I can't do it. I'm too scared. I understand you're afraid. I, too, am afflicted by my fears. But um, when your children tell you, t when your own children tell your story, will they say about the day that you were asked to be an Avenger? Hmm. I'd definitely be like, heck yeah, die for crown and country? For crown and country! Because it is the finest thing a person can be. <laughs> Take it from me, I was a king! And Avengers are better. You love to see it. Oh, oh, Cap and Sam Cap. Steve Cap, Sam Cap. Hey, Cap. She says, hey, Cap, hey, Cap. He says, hey, Cap, back. So we were like making a who's on who's on first routine was old even before I went into ice. You never get tired of the classics, Cap. Right, you are, Cap. What's up? Uh, I'm the new Avengers captain, and I'm time to assemble. How about it, Captain? Oh, uh, wait. I'm getting a bit confused. Do you mean Captain Steve, or do you mean Captain Sam? Duh. Well, I'm talking about Sam Wilson. Look, I already got Tony Thorne T'Challa. T'Challa? What are you talking about, that fool? Because he's the most dangerous man alive. And I've got a billionaire super genius, a former king... King of Gods, me, and, oh, me, an alien hybrid boss of space. Obviously, I need a Captain America. But more than that, I need a normal person. A war hero, a man of his time. Living legend Steve Rogers isn't that anymore. No offense, Cap. <laughs> None taken. I don't know what that means. He's not, oh, he's not a normal person? Is that why? Sure he is. He just has some superhero strength. I mean... Does Sam have any powers? But you, Sam Wilson, social worker, are the closest thing we have to a normal. And Avengers aren't gods. We can't afford to act like it. So we need you to remind us to have that grounded perspective. So we can count on your shield? Captain Marvel to Captain... Oh, Captain America to Captain Marvel. Something's happening down there. The birds are picking up a huge electromagnetic flux. The birds? Oh, I should have known. What is, wait, I thought, the bird. Oh yeah, the birds. Here I've been throwing my money away on satellites because the birds can see the magnetic fields. That's how they are communicating. Whoa, what was that? Thor got knocked into outer whatever. That was Thor. Terminus isn't surrendering too easily. Iron Man to the Avengers? Stark stats, four just clocked him. That's Thor's in orbit? Oh, they really knocked him into another dimension, planet, whatever. Falcon. Wait, he says Panther. He says Falcon. Don't you know his new name is not Falcon? The bird saves a cat. This is a surprising development. There may be a lot of beef between us, but you're still an Avenger, and it's Captain. America, sucker. Just got falcon wings still. All right, four days later, four days ago, the North Pole. So what's taking the cherry out of your pie? Do you remember Judgment Day? You mean when Tony Stark's bootstrap celestial, celestial judged everyone? So that was four days ago. Oh, yeah. So this is in the past, this Terminus thing. And it it's confirmed it was Tony Stark's bootstrap celestial judge that he created? Kind of hard to forget. It was an unprecedented event. Everything, every thinking creature on the planet confronted with their own sins and triumphs, knowingly and unknowingly, a collective trauma that united the world in its terror. What are you talking about, Vision? Yeah, I remember. I guess it's considered rude to ask about other people's. Go ahead, Carol. Ask me about mine. All right, Vision. What was your judgment like? I didn't have one because, well, a lot of people didn't have one, or at least they didn't know that it was happening. But they don't live with the uncertainty, Carol. Was I, like a portion of people, simply unaware? Or despite everything, I... I've done to prove myself a person. Did the God consider me just a machine? 
unfit of judgment? Is that so, Carol? Am I just a machine? Look, some Frankenstein space god didn't make you relive all the trauma that you had in your life. When did the Vision ever care about what God's thought about him? Vision, who, unlike the rest of us, actually met his creator and told him to go to H-E double hockey sticks. I don't want you on my team to prove yourself all over again, Vision to the Avengers. I want you on my team because you already have proved yourself. I have Thor and I'm returning to the conflict zone. Please, clear the blast radius. Is, what, did he just, did he just like, is that him doing this? I can't tell. Ah. Uh, leave me vermin, I must grow stronger. Ew. Stronger? The convergence is coming. Convergence is coming. Iron Man to Black Panther, what's the story? The remit of Project Pegasus is to explore alternative sort power resources. Their latest program, an artificial black hole reactor. And Terminus wants it. Yeah, do you want the good news or do you want the bad news? Huh. Well, sure, I'll take the good news. That was a trick. I'm the Black Panther. I don't have good news. Oh, so we're doing jokes now. <laughs> Either Terminus isn't as intelligent as he believes himself to be, or he's desperate. His attack has damaged the reactor's containment flask, and the black hole will be released upon the whole world. What shall we do? We may want to start evacuating the state. Sounds like we need someone. Ugh. Yes! Yes, queen! Yes! Excuse me. So three days ago, before this whole event took place, someone who can do the impossible. And she's like, yes. The answer is yes. Well, well, I didn't even ask. Did you read my mind? No, but I know you, and I know the Avengers, and the Avengers have been the one point of my state, one point of stability in my entire life. And if they're calling, then the Scarlet Witch is answering, baby. Yes, Wonder Maxim Hop is the greatest. Scarlet Witch to the Avengers. I can contain the black hole with a spell, but the overlapping magnetic field of the Project Pegasus facility is interfering with my magic, and I need someone to clear, clear. Scarlet, oh, Captain Marvel, Scarlet Witch, I'm on it. Hey, T'Challa, Cap, are you not needed out there? Well, I've got good news and bad news. What do you want first, bad news? Iron Man and Vision are keeping Terminus busy, but that's only going to last so long. And the good news, there is good news, if I'm correct. You bet there is. Thor is awake. Oh, that boy woke up. He is mad. Where? Where's the electricity? Right here. I don't know. Where? What is it? What is it? I don't know. But he's awake. All right. I've got the reactor, and it's not very happy. So it's like making sounds. Are you ready for the magic? Yes, Captain Marvel. I'm going to need you to keep Terminus off me. On it. Black Panther and Captain Marvel, the reactor is dangerously unstable. You need to put dis distance between yourself and it immediately. I dropped this black hole and it's the, I don't need, know what the Adirondacks, T'Challa, I don't know what that means, including the end of you all. Wanda, are we ready for that spell yet? Cause we're running out of time. No. Carol, you need more altitude. You're not clear of the electromagnetic footprint. Oh, God dang it. I'm here. I'm on the rescue. We call ourselves the Avenger as a warning. Not for our enemies, but for ourselves. Because to avenge something, you must have lost it. In this world, this earth, our earth, we can't afford to lose no matter what. No matter what. Wanda, cast the spell now. This is Captain America on the intercept. What is he? He's going to catch her, right? I don't know. This is the part I was telling you about. What? What the? Where am I? Oh, it's about time. Who? Uh, you have come to my deathbed, Carol Danvers. The deathbed of Kang the Conqueror. They got rid of Jonathan. What's his name? He's no longer the black man. They switched it back to the old king. Woo! We must speak. I have a warning for you. 
Kang is back in the picture, baby.